Hello everyone, welcome back to the Heathland and today we're making cookies. Basically I was going to film a Q&A and I didn't get as many questions as I thought and I fancied cookies so I thought hmm what an excellent idea but to combine the two ideas together. So if you're new here, hey welcome to the Heathland, my name's Heather. Subscribe down below for vlogs, fashion, music, whatever the hell else I might decide to make. I normally look a lot better than this, I'm sorry. So, basically, ages ago, I got this Intesto cookie mix. I fancied brownies, like, must have been months ago now. And we picked up some cookie mix as well. And I thought, hmm, might be a good idea to make the cookies while answering your questions. I asked questions over on Instagram, on my story, and I'm just going to answer the questions that you asked me. My Instagram is linked down below. It's the Heathland. Uh, it's a good time over there. Always spamming. And you guys seem to like it. So, preheat oven to 180 degrees fan. It's a baking tray with grease proof paper. Got it. I need scissors. Lolly. Excellent, I'm a genius. Right, three, empty the cookie mix into a large mixing bowl and add butter and water. Melted butter, oh bloody heck. Where are the scales? Calling me mother. Hiya. Hi, um, I'm going to make cookies. Where are the scales? Oh hang on, doesn't butter have that thing where it has 50 grams? It has 50 grams marks on it. Uh, I've just remembered, I'm an idiot, never mind. I didn't even need the bloody scales. Butter. Poppity ping. How long, f how, ooh, how long do I put them to melt for her? The microwave is on. Got the bowl. Empty the cookie mix into large mixing bowl. Why is it popping like popcorn for? What's all that about? 15 millilitres of cold water. How do I work out 15 freaking millilitres? Do these, do the spoons do you know? Got one, got one of the spoons. Look, it's a pig. washing machine about to come on but basically I've got the cookies and I've made seven instead of six and I feel like that might bite me in the butt but we're gonna go for it. Five. They're quite high up. I don't know if that's an issue also. No, leave them there. Yeah. I'm going to come back and check these guys in ten minutes. So now I'm gonna answer your questions. I was gonna answer questions in the kitchen but obviously the washing machine came on, so we're in the living room. Let's see what you guys asked. Asked, asked, asked. You get the point. I had a lot of questions about like, why I wanted to start YouTube, when did I start YouTube? Like, a lot of questions. So I'm not gonna name like one specific person, but thank you for asking that question, if you did. Um. So when I started YouTube, I started in, God, 2013, I think. I mean, like most YouTubers who were like, oh, I watched so-and-so and then I became inspired. I didn't start like that. Um, when I was younger, <laughs> I used to make video stars on this app called Video Star. I'm sure most of you will know of it. And you could be put on like the Video Star app on the featured page. And I was like, whoa. 
I want to do that. To be able to do it, you had to post to YouTube. So that's exactly what I did. I made a channel and just started uploading, I guess. And that was, God, five years ago. So I just started posting videos on, it was on a completely different channel. And ever since then, so then I started watching other YouTubers, which I'd already been kind of doing, but I was starting to subscribe to people because I actually had a channel. And then I made a packing for my holiday video on that channel. And then in 2014, I decided to create the channel that I'm on now, except it is, the name's changed a lot. So it started off as the Desolate Dalek and my editing was hilariously appalling. And then I was had this broadcast, which some of you might remember. And then now here we are as the Heathland. So yeah, that's how I started YouTube, I guess. The Life of Becca YT on Instagram asked me, what do you want to be when you grow up? This one kind of makes me laugh because it's like, you get asked this like your whole entire life and it's kind of, it's kind of surreal now because it's like, I kind of am grown up. Uh, ah. <laughs> um, but my aspirations for career goals, um, I want to go, I want to either be an actor, I, I desperately want to be an actor, or a musician, slash singer, slash, basically I want to go to performing arts desperately, but I'd also be very content in becoming a teacher now. I've been volunteering at my old high school in the teaching, and I do really love it. Obviously it's not a world famous actor, but I would equally enjoy that. So that's my goals for the future. Becky Patterson with two Y's on the Becky on Instagram asked me what's my favourite flavour of crisps? This is weird because I never used to like crisps growing up as a kid but now I love them. Um, Pringles, cheese and onion, sour cream and onion and the barbecue ones, they're like some of my faves. I love Skips, barbecue hula hoops, gorgeous. They're my faves I guess. Underscore Amy.yt on Instagram asked me, where do you see yourself in five years time? Ugh, that's a scary one. Um, I guess, I think either way, whether or not I end up going to uni first time round or second time round, I'd probably be done with uni by that point, which is scary as heck. Um, I'd like to see myself in a job of some form, whether it be acting or teaching, whether or not it's just getting more experience or trying to get acting jobs, something like that. And I'm, I still want to be playing music, I still want to be filming videos, hopefully. Just, hopefully I'm just in a comfortable situation and I want to be happy in five years time, that'd be nice. Tegan Beauty underscore asked me, what do you edit with? And then said, love you IBF, love you too. Um, I edit with iMovie on my phone and to be honest, I really enjoy editing, it's so much fun. I also sometimes use uh, Video Star for other things because um, it's still in my heart. But I really love editing videos and I'm so excited to eventually get a like new computer and use that to edit because I really, really love it. Um, it's Soph asked, how old are you? I'm 17, 18, next March the 5th, which is scary as heck. And she also asked me, do you like Harry Potter? And the answer is, yes I do. There's a video up there, that is a video all on Harry Potter, which is pretty cool, you can go check that out. And hopefully I'm going to be going at Christmas time to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter in London for the second time with my mum and I'm super excited if we can make that happen. I'm just gonna put the name on screen because I really don't wanna butcher it. Um, favorite thing that I've done this summer? My favourite thing I think I've done so far is go on holiday. I did post a holiday vlog on Wednesday, so if you saw that, great. If you haven't already, go and watch it. It's one of my fave videos ever. And that would probably be my favourite thing I've done so far. I-O-Y Evie, hey, um, asked me, how long have you loved music for? This is like such a good question. Um, oh gosh. I've always been kind of a performer. I've always loved 
to perform like ever since I was young, acting especially. And I remember when I was like in year two, so I was like six or seven, I performed in like the talent show singing a song from a Barbie film. Like I've always kind of had a thing for music, but I'd say I really fell in love with playing music and singing in like year nine probably. I started to realise it was something I really loved and then I picked it for GCSE and ever since I've been really, really more orientated and wanting to do more musically. Melissa, with three A's at the end, Brack X asked me, what is your biggest fear and do you miss making video stars? Um, my biggest fear, I'm scared of a lot of things to be honest, um, not gonna lie, um, the dark, fire, confined spaces, being alone, there's a long, there's a long list, I guess, but there are some of the main ones, really. Do I miss making video stars? You know what? I do, like, quite a lot. I wouldn't go back to making them, but there are times where it was like, I just really loved doing it, and it was such a cool community, and I used to be part of, like, a collab channel with Melissa who asked a question, and it was so much fun, and, like, we all bonded so much, and, like, Tiana is one of my really good internet friends, was on that channel as well and I do miss that and I do miss doing it because it was like a combination of music and acting and I loved that so yeah I guess I do kind of miss it oh the cookie's ready hang on let's go <laughs>